Hey guys, welcome back. Um, this is going to be a quick video, uh, but I'm going to address one of the most common problems I hear people have um, when they're uh, when they're cutting artwork on their CNC plasma table. A lot of times you'll you'll buy an SVG off of Etsy or iStock or or one of those, and some of the lines will be too fine to cut uh, on your plasma cutter because uh, basically they melt through. So let me show you very quickly how we can thicken up lines in Illustrator. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up um, one of these monogram files that I have. And I just know from experience that the lines in this letter K and, and all the other files that came with this monogram set, these lines are too thin. Uh, my plasma cutter is actually going to melt through these. So let me show you how to do this. All we're going to do is we're going to select the entire artwork and we'll just draw a line around it uh, with our selection tool. I'm going to go up to object, then path, and then offset path. Once you're in this offset path mode, um, I found that generally 0 0.02 or 0 0.03 um, inch offset will work. Uh, I can click over in this other box to apply it. And you'll see that I have thickened up my lines quite a bit. The scroll work still looks very nice, um, but now I have nice thick lines uh, that I can cut on my plasma cutter. I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And I just want you to know that what the offset tool does is it actually creates another instance of what you had selected the first time. And if I mouse over, you can see that the original is here on top, and then the offset one is actually in the back. You want to delete this front one. Let me uh, let me ungroup these. You want to delete these front ones and just leave the ones in the back. Otherwise, you're going to have trouble uh, when you go to, to cut this on your plasma cutter. So that is how to make lines thicker in Illustrator uh, using the offset tool. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next time.